Hello friends, in this video <clears throat> I'm going to show you how to add smartly or how to uh, check your answers uh, by uh, doing different strategies of adding. Okay, so let's get started. So uh, the first question is you have to add 758 uh, plus 597. Okay. So there are different ways of adding it, okay. and uh, the good thing about different strategies is that you can check your answer in different ways. So you don't need to limit yourself to one way of adding. If you know one way, that's fine, but later on when you learn maths, the different strategies will help you to understand the different uh, concepts of maths. So it's very good. Uh, if you know different ways of adding and subtracting. So I'm going to start with addition. So this is a simple example, 758 plus 597. So when you have a number like 758, each number has a place value. Okay, so 7, you should not see as a 7. This 7 stands for, this is in the hundreds place. So this 7 let me write that this is in the hundreds place so 7 you should see as 700 phi is in the tens place so phi you should see as 50 and this 8 is in the ones place or units place ones or units place okay both are right. So 8 is nothing but 8. And that's how you read it, 758. So if you add, if you want to add it, there are different ways. I will try to do in two different ways. Okay, so one way of adding is, the first strategy is, to write them in the, write the numbers according to the place value. So I'll write this as 700 plus 50 plus 8. So what I've done is, I have written 7 as 700, 5 as 50, and 8 as 8. Plus, so this is a column of hundreds, this is a column of tens, and this is a column of 1. So 597, or 597 can be written as 500 plus 90 plus 7. So you just simply add now. So you go 500, 700 plus 500, which is 1200. This is 50 plus 40, so 50 plus 90 is 140. And 7 plus 8 is 15. So now just you have to add them. So this is, if you just, if you want to still separate this in groups, so this is 1200 plus 100 plus 40 plus 10 plus 5. So this, let me add the hundreds. So these are the hundreds, these are the tens, and this is the ones. So this becomes 1300 or 1300 plus 50 plus 5. Okay? And now this li our life becomes so easy. So 1355 or 1355 is the answer in one way of doing it okay so let us look at a different way now this is a way in which you are grouped the hundreds the tens and the ones in the respective columns okay the second strategy you can do in different ways uh, but i'll do the second exam second way 758 plus 597 so this is called adding by compensating <coughs> you don't need to remember the names names are not important so what i'm thinking is i want to make this a tidy number so 597 i know is very close to 600 so what happens if i add 3 to this so this will become 300 sorry 600 so if you add 3 to this 
you have to take away 3 from this. Now to explain this, I'll give you a very simple example. Suppose let us take, say, 7 plus 9. Okay, most of you should know 7 plus 9 is 16. But what if I don't know 7 plus 9 is 16? So I'll say, well, how can I, if I make this, if I increase this by 1, I want to make this a 10, I have to take away 1 from this number. So this becomes 6 plus 10, which is 16. So this is called adding by compensating. You're adding something to the number to make it tidy. So that much you have to take away from the other number. So that's what I did. I, may, I have added 3 to make it 600. So this becomes 755 plus 600. Now again you can do this like this. 700 plus 50 plus 5 plus 600. So 700 and 600 gives you 1300 plus 50 plus 5, which is 1355. Okay, now you can, there's nothing wrong in also the algorithm, which most of you may be knowing. This is 758 plus 597. Okay, so algorithm is helpful if you know what's happening. So what we are doing is, you add 8 and 7 is 15. Okay, so this is in the 1's place and this is in the 10's place. So 15 is 110 and 15. Okay, so that's why we write 1 here because this is in the 10's place. Now, this is 10. This 1 is 10. 10 plus 50 is 60. And 60 plus 90 is 160. Okay. So you write 6 here. Okay. You write 6 here. This is how you do generally do 1 plus 5 is 6. And 6 plus 1 plus 5 is. No, I made a mistake. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So yeah. What do, this is how we do. So 1 plus 5 is 6. 6 plus 9 is 15. So basically what's happening here is. This is 10 plus, 10 plus 50 is 60, and 60 plus 90 is 150, okay. So, <clears throat> 150 has 150, so this phi stands for the 50, and you've got 100, okay. So, 150 is written as 1, this is 150, okay, and then you add simply 1 plus 7 is 8, and 8 plus 5 is 13. So basically what we are doing is, this is 100 plus 700 is 800, and 800 plus 500 is 1300. Okay, let me move on to the next question. This is 406 plus 399 plus, I want you to pause the video and try to do it the way you saw in the first part. Okay, and... Uh, you can pause the video for, say, five minutes and then listen to the video. So, hopefully you got it right. Now you can check your working. So, this is 400 plus 0 ones, sorry, 0 tens plus 6 ones plus, this is 300 plus 9 tens, okay, or you can write, this is 300 plus 90 plus 9, and this is again plus 300 plus 90 plus 0 ones. Now simply add, four, 6 plus 9 is 15, so you write a 5 here, and you take the 10 over. So this is 10, and 5 is 15. Now 90 plus 90 is 180, and 180 and 90 is 190. So 190 is 100, like put it here, and put a 90 here. Because this is the tens place. You can't write 190 here because this is only in tens. Now this is in hundreds. 
so this is 500 plus 300 is 8 500 plus 800 and 1100 okay so this is 1100 am i right 406 plus 300 plus 90 plus 9 300 plus 90 plus 0 so we will check this so this is 15 so i'm right so okay i'm a bit so 600 1000 1000 so the answer is 1195 okay i'm right just checking okay now the next way of doing it is so let me write the question again okay I, let me write it here so this is 406 plus 399 plus 390 so i'm thinking this is very close to 400 why don't i make it 400 so if i add one here i have to take away one from this number or this number doesn't make any difference so i'll take away one from here so this becomes 405 plus 400 plus 390 now you can do this is 805 this and this gives you 805 plus 390 again if you want to make life easier so this is 800 plus 300 plus 90 plus 5 so this is 390 and 805 so i grouped the hundreds together to make life easier so this is 1100 plus 95 which is 1195 i'll continue this in the next video in subtraction see you in the next video